Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today is June 29th. This is the second last video of the month. It's coming to an end. It's really exciting for me. It is Saturday. Saturday is a day that I do focus on house things, laundry, clean the house, all that good stuff. So I've been busy today doing that kind of thing. I still have a couple of listings that I want to list today. And what I just did is I on Fridays and Sundays, I usually turn off my automated offers to likers because I can participate in closet clear out if I want to. I just turn them back on with a bit of a deeper discount to see if it will drum up any sales, which would be a really good way to end the month. But long weekends are a little weird. Sometimes they can be super busy and sometimes, you know what, they're not. It is a long weekend here, just in case you don't realize that. In Canada, Canada Day is Monday, so we are in the middle of a long weekend. Post offices are closed on Monday here in Canada, as well as your cross-border shippers. They will be closed. And then on Thursday, USPS will be closed as well, because it's July the 4th. So, it's going to be a wacky kind of week. It might have a week where it's a little bit slow to start, or a little bit sort of off because people will be starting vacations and you know at the beginning of the week at the end of the week so it's going to be a little bit different um yeah so like i said i'm only going to do a little bit of listing today i didn't do a live show today i didn't do a silent show i think i will uh get one scheduled for tomorrow one or two maybe well uh, what i'll do is i'll try two at different times like one really early in the morning and then one in the afternoon or something something like that but in all honesty, I will be taking tomorrow off. I'm going to do a bit of work in the morning and then about noon, that's it. I'm done. I have company coming, my daughter and my grandson are coming and my daughter's husband. So I'm looking forward to that time away and I'm going to actually enjoy it and put the phone away and put the business away as much as I possibly can. I will still answer questions and whatever. So I got a kitten. Anyway, <laughs> he's around here. I hear him. What I wanted to sort of talk today about is bolos. Bolos are be on the lookout for. They are items that technically should sell really, really fast for fairly good money. And they're little items that, you know what? Yeah, if you find them, they're fantastic. Oh, he crawled up here. Um, so if you hear someone talking about a bolo, a certain brand, and honestly, I don't know if I have a brand that I would consider a bolo. You know unless they're like a really big brand that everybody knows but even with those brands that people talk about still doing your own research and i say that because different styles within brands just don't sell as well uh your price point is important so if you have to pay up for them it might not be enough for you to make profit and bolos change what was <coughs> pardon me it was really popular last month or you know two months ago or last summer may not be popular anymore or the market may be oversaturated with those items so that they do change so you really really need i'm talking with my hands and the kittens bobbing his head to it silly boy anyway bolos change i think they're a fabulous sort of thing to keep in mind because i like hearing about new brands and i will definitely check them out if I find them in my local thrift stores. So I think it's a really good thing to have on your radar, but do your own research with it as well. Just because someone says Levi sell, doesn't mean that the Levi's that you can get will sell for the same amount. Just keep that in mind. Anyway, this is a really, really short video. I hear Paul is just home as well. It's been a crazy day. He actually took things down to a new auction house that we discovered last week was it last week i did an auction run where i got the brat stalls no yeah the brat stalls um anyway he took some stuff down and i'm gonna find out if she accepted some of them and they should be in the next auction which is really exciting i'll let you know what happens there anyway that is it for today i will be back tomorrow with the last video of the month we'll round up all the information that happened this month talk about how sales were a little bit that kind of stuff but then I'm taking Monday off because I have company and I de deserve a bit of a rest but I'll be back tomorrow so I'll see you then bye